With all the hype around the 2021 NFL schedule release dropping, it's, oh yeah, there's preseason as well in 2021. Woo! Pretty excited about it. And under the new CBA, there's only 20 total games allowed between preseason and regular season. Hence, with the new 17-game schedule, now there's only three preseason games. And week one, the Vikings will host George Payton and... Hey, tear dame. And the Broncos week one. Week two, dead ass Carson Wentz and the Colts, as well as Xavier Rhodes. What up? Rocking the U.S. Bank Stadium. Week three at the Kansas City Chiefs, where the Vikings can visit all the offensive linemen that they missed out on in free agency and also Orlando Brown Jr., but whatever. Now, I know people scoff at preseason. All the games don't count. Oh, these guys are going to be working at Foot Locker in a hot second. I'm a season ticket holder and I got to pay for all this fake football. Don't care. Don't care. Give those tickets to the family members that you don't like. Right, do that. Uh, but it's important for the team on multiple levels. Number one, the starters have a chance to get their feet wet, get their timing down, start building chemistry in game situations. Also, fringe roster guys have a chance to show their wares at, on the field instead of just practice. We talk about practice, man. Plus, preseason games are huge for rookies coming into the league. Hey, rookie, what up? Small things like game day routine. What time do you get to the stadium? Team bus, team hotel, team travel. Uh, how the locker room is set up. Uh, getting ankles taped with the training staff. Stretching, pregame warm-ups. Where do you stand? Where do you do this? All of that is in docked in preseason. Like, imagine rookies last year especially since the Vikings were so reliant on young players, especially rookies, their first NFL action was regular season. So all of those things, all those ancillary things, taking up all that bandwidth as opposed to just focusing on the game, it's important. It, it is. Also, small things like getting used to TV timeouts. I mean, that's all important. Also, let's not forget that offense corner Clint Kubiak, this will be his first time calling plays ever. Ever. Would you rather him get his feet wet in the three preseason games this year or... You know, the first time out on the mic uh, when the games count in Cincinnati. Nah, nah. Uh, especially since the Vikings have to start out the season fast with two games on the road. Uh, ask the 2020 Vikings who start out 1-5 and five if preseason games matter. It would be kind of nice to have a couple of tune-up games. Plus, let's not forget, we get to see Kellen Mond in action, baby. The future franchise quarterback, third-round pick. He'll probably start the third preseason game against Kansas City since Week 2 will now likely become the de facto dress rehearsal. But sh he should see significant time in all three games. So preseason's back, baby. Viva la preseason. You love it. Let's go. Uh, beer thoughts, Vikings preseason opponents, and why it's important, by the way. Let us know in the comment section below. Subscribe for daily Vikings takes. Want to support that work? Post on the Venmo. But until next time, Skull Production Value.